It's 615 time for Ask Trooper Steve. We answer questions you send in today. It's something about license plates. Yeah, I like this question here. So this is what we're talking about. Specifically, any idea why Florida does not have a front and rear plate? Well, let's talk about it a little bit. This is a good one, not necessarily traffic safety, but some rules, right? So Florida does not require uh, for us to have a plate on the front of our car. We only get issued one for the back of your vehicle. We've been a single plate state since 1922. Hmm. So if anyone's been around then, they will be like, well, I remember that. So, but think about it for a second. If we had the extra plates, it, it would cost us more. It would ultimately come to us. So we did have two plates from 1918 to 1922, and adding a second plate, like I said, would cost more for the state and ultimately cost us some more when we have to go register that stuff. So if you do get to drive in another state, there are 18 of them throughout the country that require a front and rear plate. As long as your vehicle mm -hmm. is registered to the state of Florida, or if the vehicle that is rented is uh, registered here in the state of Florida, then you'd be exempt. They won't enforce their state laws on a registered Florida driver. Just make sure you're cruising around, make sure your tag's updated. If you got that one plate, you're good to go. Good to know. If you have a question for Trooper Steve, let him know. Go to clickorlando.com slash Trooper Steve.